so as a photographer or as a hobbyist you will be having thousands or tens of thousands of uh, photographs and videos and you would like to want a software which would help you in managing all of those by tagging essentially because tagging is critically important so let's say if your workflow includes uh, the process in which uh, you want to tag the ones which you have uh, processed like the photos or the videos which you have processed uh, and uh, and you want to apply tags to them then uh, that will be possible using digicam because digicam is a professional photo management software which is powered by the open source so if you are an open source fanatic perfect and if you want to save some money um, in buying any photo management software then this is like the perfect software for you although it is a bit complex and uh, it may not be very intuitive and it may crash uh, at times or uh, there will be some silly issues uh, because of which you would not like but uh, this is one of the best softwares which you can use for managing uh, all of your photos and uh, videos so i experimented with a lot um, and try to find uh, different ways to form my workflow and i will be sharing you all of that learnings in this video so first step is to go to digicam.org uh, to download this software so as to, as soon as you will go and visit this software you will be seeing some details so it's uh, it, it would be nice to read all the documentation but no one does that so just click on download and uh, just click on any of these links so let's say if you're using linux then you can just download linux one uh, i have downloaded the mac one and at times uh, the Mac uh, Digicam can become pain, a real big pain. Uh, so you must know how to manage a few things like how to uninstall it properly, how to install it properly, how to use um, Digicam, how to move photographs to the albums, all of those things. And one uh, big tip is um, experiment with uh, with with let's say five ten duplicate files and just move them or use them within this uh, digicam because in case you won't and if you will if you will just start learning f using the actual photographs then it might so happen that you will lose your data or the data will duplicate to great extent and you would end up wondering and wasting a lot of time so session is to use digicam for the first time using the dummy photograph so that you would know at least or you can just get familiar with the ui or how application works things like that so as soon as you are done with the downloading part and you want to install it you can just run the installer and uh, the application will be executed one thing to know is that you should be reading all of those instructions very carefully which will show up uh, uh, in the installer dialog because uh, those contains really important things although the Although this video has those uh, uh, recorded, but for your reference, you can keep uh, your eyes on that installer as well because the lots of interesting instructions are over there. So let's start the installation process. Thanks so much for watching this tutorial. If you liked it, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you didn't, then leave a comment so that we can improve it further. Do watch these suggested tutorials to learn even more. And do let us know what you want to learn on being skilled.